uh, Los Angeles in several productions. Please welcome to the stage the very talented, very funny Mr. Jeffrey Lemon. <laughs> Thank you. There's like eight people here that know exactly why that's oh so funny. Thank you. I'm 10 years old, I'm at the local duplex. The science fiction matinee at two. I don't recall the movie, but the aliens were groovy, and I wondered how they make the actors blue. So when I get home, I fill the tub with fizzies. 30, 40 fizzies, purple grape. I soak for seven hours. I get these funny streaks. They won't come off in showers. People laugh at me for weeks. But I knew, thought I knew, and at 10, it was a mighty heady brew on my skin, in my hair. I fell in love with the research then and there. And I thought, check it out. I've locked into what my life is all about. And thus, it didn't matter when they chuckled at my hue. I was 10, I was blue, and I knew. All right, moving on. In senior high, I'm taking health and hygiene. Birth control techniques are where we're at. The teacher's going on, how best and strongest is the condom. I'm wondering, well, just how strong is that? So comes the yearly science competition. I snap the sheet, my project is unveiled. The rubber prophylactic, how it functions under stress. The faces on the faculty, you'd think I wore a dress. But I knew had it graft. For the rubber tip, the reservoir, the shaft. Had machines testing length. Liquid mercury for gauging tensile strain. How'd I do? Hard to tell. See, the girls thought it was interesting as hell. Though the guys were doubled over and the principal, who, who, he's offended, I'm suspended, but I knew. And I need to know. The unknown steps up to dare me. And I tell it, you don't scare me with my head between its jaws. Why? Now that's a beautiful word. The second best there is, the very best there is, is because. I'm all grown up, I'm working at the lab here. In search of something new, my days are spent. When this holographic deal starts behaving like she's real. Silly me, I'm thinking this is an event. Doc, it frames the supernatural in science. It changes metaphysics into fact. Is there something after dying, like an afterlife or God? And the reason why you're sighing, like you find my interest odd? I don't know, but I will. You can bet your chips and diodes that I will. If it's war, then it's war, ha! Consequences never bothered me before. Ain't the fame, ain't the perks. It's the simple finding out how something works. I figure here's a mystery just waiting to get solved. And yes, I'm getting pissed because you don't want to get involved. Go read the job description, Doc. Discovering this shit is what we do. I want to feel like I'm 10 all over again. 